Okay. Hey, welcome back to another episode of Megan and Mo. I'm Megan. I'm Mom, Megan and Half. I'm Mo. Mo. And if this is your first time watching our video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Um, this is our other channel that where we we have we have a real conversations, you know, real adult conversation, me and her. Um, and um, no, baby, get up, please. Get up. You know, I know we haven't. She's sitting on the grass. But I don't know if there's anything there. There's nothing there. Okay, so. Okay. Come, Noe. Anyway, no, no. Let me sit over there at the bench. It's going to go off. Oh, all, right, all, right, all right, all right, all right. Um, so. My baby is here. Okay, um, go sit on the chair. Like I said, I know, I know we haven't posted a video right. in a few months, but that's because we've been so focused on our other channel. Yep. Which is. Three cases and a lady. And uh, so, you know, so now we feel like it's, it's a good time to get back to it. Okay, anyway. Without further ado, this is today's topic is are you willing to risk it all for a one or two minutes of Ugh. That sounds so disgusting. That's the, the that's that's the sound you make when you bust a nut. Anyway, are you willing to throw it all away for that? And what I mean by that is because you know between us men, like like right when I'm at work and things like that, we have these conversations, right, about women. I mean, you can know how it is. Well, you know, that that conversation always happens, right? About oh, you know, this this one is this one is this, right? But then the conversation stops because the question one person will ask the question, "Your way, would you would you like would you do it? Like if if you had a shot to you know to sleep with another girl, another woman, whatever, you know, why well, you would there? you? Why never risk of you know the, the question get asked? Would you you know? Um, for me specifically, every time I hear that question. The things I always say. The first, I said, I said two words at first. It's always he your hand is like all up in my face. Sorry, when I vlog, I usually use my hand. I'm somebody important. So anyway, I be seen. anyway. <laughs> so the first thing. Thank you. The first two words I always say is hell no, right? And then I follow that up with um, like do you? It should be hell no at year ten in our relationship, but hell yeah, I'll think about it at year three. No, I'm stupid. I uh, why can we can you can we okay. we should go back down memory lane for y'all. No. Go ahead. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Nothing happened memory lane. <sighs> Not to you. Not okay. I said but something to happened. Me. Uh, to me, something happened. Exactly. You said, and you said no exactly. too. So exactly. Okay, but, whatever. Yeah. Anyway, see? so I always follow up, follow it up with <laughs> with uh um yeah, fat um, and greasy. You realize I'm not going nowhere. Me? It's like, yeah. Me? Fat and greasy? Cause, it's because you got fat and greasy, so you realize that I'm you're not, not going nowhere and I'm not going nowhere. So now it's like, yeah, uh, I'm not going to risk it. Of course not. What when he was all slim and wearing European style cigarette pants, he was ready to risk it all. What? Okay, first of all, there's nothing, there's there's no risk. There's nothing that you risk in when you're in year one, if you were, that's what you're talking about. There's not really, there's nothing that you risk. In. There isn't. When you build a foundation, uh -huh. then there's there's something. Yes. Huh? There's nothing that you're risking. That. But now she messed up my whole thought of what I was missing. All right. So there's nothing. There's nothing you're risking in year ten of the relationship, or at this point in the relationship. Bring it back. I want to talk about year ten. No. Let me finish my thought. You're messing my stuff up. Go ahead. At this point in time in the relationship, he felt like there's nothing. To be risked by going ahead and going after. <laughs> That's not what I said. What? That's not That's what I right. said. All right, go ahead. That's Gio. not what I said. Go ahead, do it on your own. You, you have your take. Let me have my take. All right. That's not what ahead. I said. I said. Yep. There's the risk right there. I said. Thank you. Do he you got think slapped this, and I got a kiss in the lip. Do you think at this point in my life, I'm willing to risk uh, all the work that I put in in building my foundation, right? Because that, I kind of. Rod and Jackie, you guys? Because that's, that's what I call my family, right? The one that I helped build. That's my foundation. That's, you know, a lot of uh, um, a lot of work went in there, you know? And so, am I, you know, willing to risk all of that work for... Uh, um, a because couple of seconds of pleasure. A couple of seconds. And I don't mean I don't mean the sexual act, right? Because you can have sex for 20, 30 minutes, whatever. However long you last, right? But when, when you release... It's only for like a, a few seconds, right? The release part is only unless for, you continue the relationship on a continuous basis. No, no, yeah, but I'm I'm talking about like the first the time, one time, the one time, uh -huh. yeah. I'm talking about the one time. 
So no, I mean, I, we have four kids. You know what I mean? Like, do I, like, am I, do I want to put myself in a position where I'm like, hey, Megan, yeah, so I want to have the kids this weekend. I, nobody want to do that. Like, it's, 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 I mean, this, like I said, there's a lot and of. And forgetting all that that happens before the, hey, Megan, I gotta work overtime. We're working real late tonight. Huh? Uh, don't put dinner on the table. What? You're forgetting the, that's not the very first time it stopped. Uh, no, that's not the very first time that you have to make that phone call. The very first time you make the phone call is when you're hiding the fact that you're doing it. Well, no, well, then well. Then lead to, eventually, well, once I discover it, now, hey, man, well, you yeah. get the kids. This well, weekend. yeah, well, yeah, well, yeah. So, so the, the, the work put in is two part. There's the work that we put in to build a foundation, right? To build a family, a structure, and all that stuff, right? Now, do you realize the work you have to put in to hide mm -hmm. your extracurricular activity? Mm -hmm. Like it's so much work because, you know, the woman that you're doing with or the man that you're doing with, she knows, you know, like they, they, there's a control issue at one point there where they know, okay, Keeping you want them in it. check. Yeah, so I mean, and then, and then, and then she's gonna have, uh, uh, she's gonna start taking issue with your wife, yes. Where's the phone? Oh, you give it I to have me. it for you. Okay, Mom. you know. So yeah, so that the work is two for yeah, I forgot that part. Yeah. So the amount of work that goes into uh hiding it and, and and you know and pretending and then okay, I'll be right back, I'll be right back, I gotta go, I gotta go, I gotta go here, you know. And making time, making excuses out of your busy schedule, running the family and, and then working. coming home and dealing with the nagging and the being asked questions and the what's really going on and lying, nothing's going on, yes it is, no it's not. It's just a a revolving door of secrecy. So that's my take on it. That's my take. The word that, that I put in to build my foundation, I'm not willing to risk risk it all for a five second of ooh, right? I'm not willing to do that. Just because then what the hell did I put all this work in for? You know? And then the, the second part is the amount of work that, that's it's less relevant to me, but the amount of work that goes into you hiding it, right? You running around, you know, making, uh, trying to find time in your schedule to meet with the person and then, and, and then you got, you know, you, you got, I, I, bet I got 10 minutes today. Then it's just so much work that goes into it. It's not even worth it, in my opinion. Your thoughts? Uh, in my opinion, no. I, okay. I put too much time into the relationship at the stage it is at right now that I'd rather just break up versus sneak around with somebody else. Like, I feel like the breaking up would just be easier to do than being deceitful. Um, whether that's for the long-term effects of getting a relationship with someone else to replace parts of my relationship that are missing with my husband, or if it's just the point of, you know, sleeping with someone else to replace the uh, physical portion <laughs> that's missing with my husband. It's just not worth it either way. Um, if I'm gonna go through all that trouble, I might as well just break up with you, honestly, and then save you the heartache, and then save myself the heartache altogether as well. And yeah, it's because just real short and simple. I, I don't think nothing else has to, else has to be said towards it. Mama. Because I think what's not said enough is the heart is is you, you know one can be quickly to say okay if I'm doing it then I'm causing her heartache right? Mm -hmm. But the fact is I'm causing myself heartache <laughs> just because man that is. This is what we should we should get this. That's four of us, four of us, right? We should get them. Hi. Hi, thank, thank you, you, you too. Thank you. We should get that. I don't want that. What is that? We should get them. Um, so, yeah, so we just saw those those bicycles, the two people riding on each. We're thinking about we should get one of them. Two of those. I'm sure they cost money, but we should get, we should get them. But yeah, so anyway, you know, we're going to wrap this up. Um, uh, one thing that we decided to do this time as, as we, you know, rebooting this channel, making a mold, is that uh, we're going to do a lot of videos like this, where we just stand in the yard, stand, you know, sitting outside, sit on, you know, you see, people are saying they have this sitting on the trail, you know, like in the evening, we'll go for a walk with the kids. <laughs> no, all this other stuff. <laughs> we, <laughs> we'll do it like this a lot, which is less formal, you know. Um, because we f I felt like the way we're doing it was a little too formal, sitting at the table, setting up, you know. Now we can just sit outside, we can just sit in our bedroom, we can just stand outside, stay by the pool, and just have a conversation for this channel, you know. But uh, let us know what you think in the comment below. Would you would you risk it all? Is it, is it worth it? Let me know. And uh, if you have any suggestion, any topic that you want, you want us to, uh, to look into, to talk about, you know, let us know. If you would like to be a guest on our show, we can make it happen. And then just having these conversations, um, something that's something that you're into, whatever it is. I mean, this is not just about family. 
We just talk about family, you know, relationships, you know, life, you know, life, life in general. So you 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 know, it's like a a, a sea worth of topics, you know, in life in general. Um, so I'm gonna end this video right here. Uh, Mama went that way. She's running from uh, Norway because she's trying to feed her some some leaf, some leaves. Um, but yeah. Uh, so if this, like I said earlier, if this is your first time seeing our video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. You know, we really appreciate it. Comment down below. Let us know what you think, and we'll see you next time on for another episode of Megan and Mo. Hey.